Hey guys, it's Sigur, and a lot of misconceptions about lipstick is that if it's like really, really light, or if it's really like a dark lipstick, that you have to actually put it on really vibrant. Today I'm going to be showing you how to turn a bold lipstick into something soft and neutral that you can wear every day. Okay, so let's get started. I'm going to show you guys how this lipstick looks on me. It looks horrible. This is, um, this is from Revlon. Um, it's in Extravagant. It's number 20. It's like a very bright pink. Now, when I put it all over, I'm going to look like a clown, so be ready. Okay, so <laughs> you guys see how this look on me? I hate it so much. It's like my lips are like different. Anyways, um, I'm going to take this off really quick and show you guys how to put it on more softly. So... If I don't do it like this, I will never be able to wear this lipstick because I honestly do not like it like this. <laughs> okay, so let me take this off and I'll meet you guys back here. Okay, so I am back and this is how my normal lips look. They actually are pinkish like this. You guys can see it. They're really pink. I was born like that. Okay, so I always put Cormax on. This is the original one. It's not like the cherry. The cherry is much creamier. But the original one is a little bit more like drier and it's easier to put like apply before like as a lip base so that's what I'm going to be using it as I love Cormax as um you know for that because it just makes you look really it makes your lips way softer and it's really cheap okay so now I'm going to take my lipstick this is the same one from Revlon and Extravagant and the main problem is swiveling it all the way up you're going to Shake it down to like a little tad so you guys can barely see it. Then you're going to store it on the bottom lip. Okay, so you're just going to put a few dabs on there. Just kind of dab it like that. Then you're going to take your finger. Okay, so it makes my lips look a little bit more pinkish at the bottom. Um, my top lip is a little brownish, just a little bit. So I'm just going to dab it, dab it on. Same thing. Now you can see it actually looks a whole lot better. Okay. So if you guys want to top this off with a clear lip gloss, you can. I prefer to use purple. Just add a little extra color. I just love it. So, that's how it looks. I hope you guys like this tutorial. I'm not sure if it's showing up right. Yeah, this is how it looks. It looks more natural, so you guys can easily wear it. I completely love it, and I would definitely consider wearing this out way better than I would the first time. Okay, so I hope you guys like this tutorial. I hope it helped you guys. Um, if you like this video, comment, subscribe, rate, whatever you can um, to help me out. Um, okay, so yeah, I guess I'll see you guys later.